Well, today I'm here on the big lake. I'd love to get in the water, but I would bet it's probably at the best about 52, 53 degrees. So, no water hunting today. But we got all this nice sand here. I only come once or twice a year, I heard. Never really been that productive. It's easy for me to say that productive, but uh, yeah, you never know. And I figure I'll give it a try today. So I'll get back to you. Boy, this is just coming back screaming. High pitch like a coin. Screaming so loud, I'll bet you it's a aluminum can. Well, I moved it. Yeah, there it is. Yep, aluminum can. Onward. This is kind of breaking up. <sighs> I think it might be a bottle cap or a... Oh, no. It was one dime. It's a dime, the Roosevelt. Came back funny. It's breaking up. It's got a glow out towing. Coming in pretty good. Might be a nickel. Boy, I sure it wasn't pretty deep. There it is right there. Yep, bottle cap, that's what it was. Born in the Rockies, Coors, bottle cap. Well, onward. It's coming back nice. It wasn't very deep, neither. Now it's breaking up. In the scoop. Picture like a toy coin, and there it is. One penny. Sound like a penny? It was a penny. <clears throat> Boy, this sounds good. Let's see if you can hear it. Hear that? In the scope. In the scope. Something's rattling in there. Oh, ho, 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 Look at this. Well, I don't see any marks in it. There's something there. I can't read it. Either that's a very fresh drop, or it is probably white gold and gold gold. White, gold, and yellow gold, as they say. Well, thank you. <laughs> Look at this. Two people come walking right up the beach. The guy stepped right on it. Didn't even know it was there. 
you see my grid lines I've been working all the way since over over in there over by the tree my core is on that bench over there uh, I think a penny time and a penny is about all a couple bottle caps for this fake so worth a while thank you well this is a high pitch probably a coin no, oh, there it is. Whatever it is, what is it? Hmm. <laughs> okay, now I will move can. Explains that. Well, okay, not weird. Another high pitch. But... Well, I don't think it's a aluminum can because. Oh. Got a vehicle. Got me a vehicle. Nice high pitch, might be a coin. A <laughs> bottle cap. In here next to the picnic tables. Well, it's either going to be a coin that fell out of somebody's pocket or a bottle cap. Oh, I bought a bottle. Going back up here just off the hook tables again. Another high pitch that normally I'd say would be a coin, but probably another bottle cap. Wine bottle cap. Chasing along. Wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah, a coin. A penny. Onward. Well, I'm here in the middle of the jungle gym. It's breaking up. I have no idea what this is. It's worth anything good. Got that time. Well, it's a coin. Penny. That was coming in funny, I'll tell you. I was breaking up. It had a high pitch, but it was breaking up kind of something horrible. Onward. That's a low tone. There it is right there, right on top. Hold that. Well, this is a very quick wrap up for Wednesday, May the 16th. I went over toward the Rochester area, up on the Big Lake, Lake Ontario, and uh, worked the dry sand on, um, out there on Sotus Bay. This bay is um, the place where the rich and the famous out of Rochester come to um, uh, spend their summers, have a lot of camps there, and there's a nice beach out there on the lake. I work at beach a couple times a year. And most of the time, um, don't, yeah, the typical stuff, you know, pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters. Um, I think other people are hunting that beach with me because uh, there really should be more than that. But today I got real lucky. Um, 
besides, uh, let's see, I think I got four um, aluminum cans, which in New York State, because of the deposit, we call aluminum nickels, because there's a nickel deposit on them. Oh, I got uh, half a dozen pennies, uh, one nickel, one dime, and two quarters. Not a lot, but very good. But I did pick up that very, very nice ring. Uh, you'll see a picture on it on the end of this, uh, this video. It turns out to be 14 karat. Um, and besides what's marked inside of it, it was marked very small. Evidently it had been worn for a while. It, it had worn off considerably. But I also tested it. It does kind of test out on 14K. So it was a fairly recent drop. Um, I didn't notice while I was there this time of the year that there's a lot of people down there walking their dogs. And of course there's a pretty cool wind comes off the lake uh, this time of the year because the lake was probably only about 48 to 50 at the most. Um, probably somebody was chucking something, a lady was chucking something in the, uh, for a dog to chase uh, one of the sticks or something and the ring come off and uh, it was there and I was just lucky enough to get on top of it. So anyway, I uh, had a very good time. I probably won't go back there again until uh, the fall sometime, but uh, uh, it just proves that you can uh, uh, go anywhere, anytime, and even though other people have hunted it, there can be something new there. There's always depositors making a deposit on the beaches. Uh, thank you very much, and uh, enjoy the rest of my videos, and please like and subscribe if you would, please. Thank you.